Yo, what's up guys? Mark here. Today we're out here at Ding. Stone Mountain. We pulled up to Stone Mountain today. This is a popular mountain here in Atlanta, Georgia. Doesn't it look so nice? Super beautiful. And it's got a lake here too. Super beautiful. Stone Mountain Lake. They got grass carp and regular carp in here. Today, we're not out here to climb the mountain and we're not out here to fish, but we did come to look for some food. By the thumbnail, you probably already know what we're out here to get, some grasshoppers. Oh! Yep, we're out here trying to catch some grasshoppers. So I got my ding, my net. We're gonna use this and catch us some dinner. Many people say grasshoppers taste like shrimp. So we're gonna see if they actually do. Grasshoppers are really fun to catch and they're also pretty good. So y'all know what that's called, right? A win-win. For me, not the grasshoppers. Today, it's about 90 degrees out. Feels like 100 though, it's super humid. I already did a grasshopper catch and cook on my Mark Japanese channel, a channel where I speak Japanese and do a lot of fishing slash catching cooks. So if you haven't seen that, check it out. And also, if any of y'all want to learn Japanese, I got a channel where I teach Japanese called Studying Japanese with Mark, so check that out too. But yeah, about a year ago, I did a grasshopper catch and cook on that channel last August. And yeah, August is the perfect time. It's the perfect time of year to catch grasshoppers. Check out the turtles. They're on that rock over there. Oh. See ya. But yeah, during August, the grasshoppers, they come out of the ground like spring, I'm pretty sure, early summer. Yeah, and then they gouge themselves on grass and crops and get super big. And then they lay eggs, they lay the eggs in the ground and then they all die. And the next generation comes out the next year. Aaron. Oh, there's another one over there. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh. Yep. Oh. I already hear him. We're back. This is the spot. Oh, one right here already. Oh, there it goes. It's been a whole year. Whoa. Look at him. Look at him. It's grasshopper fever. Oh. Just that one right there. I'm going for this one. Oh. Flew away. I think I'm going to try it without the net for now. See if I could get any. But if I can't, we're going to bring out the net. Oh, this one right here. I got him. Oh, he's right here. Oh, oh. All right, right here. Ah, oh, Magikayo. They're smart and fast. I'm gonna bring out the net. Yo, yo. All right, there's no way they can dodge this net. Y'all hear that? No, oh, just a mall. None. Are you kidding me? There's a huge one right there. All right. Yo, yo. Oh, yep, got him. Yo, yo. Oh. First one. I believe this is a short horned grasshopper. Short horned grasshopper. Very common grasshopper. Pretty handsome. I'd say this one's about medium size. Yeah, these taste like shrimp because the proteins that make up their shells is, is the same as shrimp. That's why people say they taste like shrimp. All right, let's go. Grasshopper number one. Got this handy container I got from Walmart. All right, number one. Oh, he looks huge in the container. Woo, let's go, number one. All right, we got one down and many more to go. What is this? What the heck is going on here? Three of them. Look at this, three beetles. Hey, chill out. If y'all don't chill out, I won't be able to put ads on this video. All right, there's one right there. Yo, yo. Got him. Oh, he's peeking. Peeking his head. 
Got another short horn. Number two. You, oh, he, he got away. Damn. Damn, the hawk. Oh, there's a big one over here. Oh, it's Yes. Oh, there's one over here. Got him. All right, this one's not getting away. No way, Jose. Is that getting uh It's hard to see, but there's one over here. A bigger one. You Oh, got him. Got him. So when they get scared, they spit out the soy sauce looking stuff. It's just the chewed up grass. It's like their defense mechanism. It looks like this. Let's see what it tastes like. Just tastes like grass. All right. Yo, yo. All right, now we got three of them. All right, I'm about to go hard. Oh, we got a couple spiders. Got the little spider right there. And then we also got these ones. This is a different type of grasshopper from the short horned ones. Look at how long its antenna are compared to the other ones. Super long. You gotta be careful with these ones. They got fangs. Like the other grasshoppers, they will not they will not bite you. But these ones definitely bite you. I remember last time I came, it was flexing its claws. Oh! Black one! But there he is. Peace out. Yeah, just be careful with those ones. Those ones bite. Got this brown one right here. See if we can get him. One-handed. Yush. Got him. So we got this brown one right here. Looks like the same color as me. The grasshoppers, they change colors depending on their environment. So on the green, this one stands out. But there is a lot of brown grass. So there's brown ones and green ones. Yeah, we're gonna let this one go. A little tiny guy. There he goes. This one right here. They are so good. It is a challenge for sure. Oh! Yabai, yabai, yabai. Look at him. Right there. Right there. We got him. Ah, maybe I shouldn't have kept the net. Where's that? Oh, got him. We got him. We got him. Yoisho. We got him. Number three. Woo! Yeah! Victory stream feels so good. Sheesh. I've been out here for a couple hours. Catching grasshoppers is so fun. Y'all try it too, you'll get lost in it. It's hard, but that's what makes it fun. And check it out. This is how much I got. It's a bunch, huh? But when I think that my subscribers is this times a lot, that's pretty cool. Today, I'm gonna cook these up Japanese style and make inago no tsukudani. Ise no tamago tamago tamagochi inago no tsukudani. It's just now starting to thunder too. I got about a mile hike back. Time to go home. Yo, so it's been about a day. Look, they poop a lot. So after catching them, you wanna let them sit and chill for a day or so so they could poop and it'll improve the flavor a lot. Now these grasshoppers, they don't eat only grass, but also many other crops. And they actually can be like a big problem for farmers. So today we're gonna eat these and see what they taste like. Grasshoppers have a lot of protein and calcium. So they're super good for you. You know, grasshoppers are eaten in many places like Mexico, Nigeria, Japan. I think the Native Americans used to eat them as well. Today we're gonna chef them up Japanese style. We're gonna make inago no tsukudani 
Inago means grasshopper, like a certain type of grasshopper. And tsukudani is like a, it's like a simmered soy sauce and sake dish. First, we're gonna put them in the freezer to put them out, and then we're gonna prepare them. All right, I think it's about 30 grasshoppers. First, we're gonna wash them. So I think this one is actually an Inago. See how its face is round compared to these other ones with the, with the squared faces. All right, next, normally you can take the wings off and the legs off, but we're gonna leave them on, see how it is. So yeah, these are good. Next, we're gonna make the sauce. So we got some sake right here from the farmer's market, Nam Dai Moon, like three bucks, fresh bottle. We're gonna use three fourths cup. Actually, we're gonna use one cup. We're gonna put in a quarter cup. One cup of sake. We're gonna go half cup of mirin. Half cup soy sauce. Half cup. And then quarter cup of some water. Then we're gonna use one tablespoon of sugar. Actually, I'm gonna make it two. Once it starts to simmer, I throw in the grasshoppers. And we're gonna simmer this, and they're gonna—they should start to turn orange because they have the same protein in them as like shrimp and crabs. But yeah, we're gonna simmer this for 20, 30 minutes. Yeah, I'm gonna it. あめでびしょ塗りになっちゃったさっき。結構もう雨降ってたね。大丈夫大丈夫大丈夫びしょ塗りになんなかった結構も乾いてるね、お前。乾いてるね。お腹空いたお腹空いたのよいしょ。チキ
and the sauce is really rich and goes perfect with rice. Perfect with rice. Yeah, not bad at all. Good, like delicious. Totally worth it, spending that time catching them. Mm. All right, after finishing a meal, then Crystal Geyser and then my new cup oh. from my scooter part that just dropped. This is me right here. Check it out. Link in the description. <sighs> that is good. second time eating grasshoppers and yeah they were pretty good uh right now it's the beginning of august and there were some big ones but it was mostly small ones so maybe i'll go again later maybe at the end of august early september try to get some, a bunch of big ones and maybe make something else like a different dish with them they're good they're fun to catch they're good for you so it's a win 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 thanks for watching check out my merch check out my patreon check out my new scooter video don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!